Hi boys and girls! Here we are again on day 14 of chick hatching incubation and we have some of our eggs from the incubator and we have our candling station. I'm going to take some of the eggs and put them on the candler and see what's going on inside. Hopefully by day 14 uh, the bones have developed and we have some feathers and we also have the beak. So let's see what's in store when we candle our eggs. I'll take this first egg and put it on top of the candler. Oh, and you'll see it's very dark. That's the first thing you'll notice. And I'm going to flip it upside down. You can see the air space at the bottom, which has gotten bigger, which allows that chick to taste the first breath of air uh, before it starts to hatch. And we'll place it on top to see if we can notice any movement. Oh, I see it. The movements are very slight. I'll spin it around a little bit to get a different view. Side here. Whoa, that one did a little <laughs> roll there. Mm -hmm. Oh, right here, I think you can see a dark spot. Yep. It might be hard to see, it's its eye. All right. Very cool. Oh, wow, that guy's doing little backflips in there. <laughs> awesome. Let's see what's going on with this guy. Definitely see, and if I turn it this way, you can even see a little darkening of the eyes. And turn it around once more. There's certainly something moving. Definitely moving. One thing I noticed, Ms. Pavlicek, is that it's certainly a much darker shade now than it was before. Definitely darker. We'll take one more egg just to take a peek. Okay, go ahead, Wendy. All right, boys and girls, what you'll notice about this egg, there are two dark lines going around the egg. This is blood, and what we call these is, it's a quitter. What this means is that the egg was fertilized, but for some reason or another, it did not form. So what we do is we take these eggs and we dispose of them, and just as I mentioned that even after some of the chicks hatch, some of them don't survive, and some of them don't hatch at all, this is another example of a type of egg that did not make it through the in incubation. But we have lots of healthy ones, and we're very excited to see the chicks hatch. Well, boys and girls, you should be very excited. The chicks are doing very well, and I'll see you on Monday to deliver those eggs to your classroom. Thank you.